so we're gonna take a look all oh, my universal my tire last time i remember we did the bed edition where we're gonna do the table so i have one two three four a thousand movies in the universal pictures uh Um, uh, at the movies from 2000 and the way to the 90s. So, let's start with the A Movies, A Movies Animal Friends Collection. I think this is the 2015 DVD release, I believe. Yeah, it's the 2015 DVD release. So, they contain all different movies, which they had in the individually the release on individual like DVD well Beethoven number six got released MID The Adventure of Rocky and Bowinkle None of the other four I don't have in my collection. Which is kinda of sad but here are the front the side the back this one and this two the interesting thing has the, um, let me see if I take this two. You can see they have the running time on each of the films right there. So we have. Um. This one has the adventure rocking boy with the movie Ed Flipper and Two Brothers. This two has Babe, Pig in the City, Beethoven Five and Six, and Ed Money. Ed Money. That was A Movies, Animal Friends. Next to the 1978 film, Robert, starring Robert De Niro in The Deer Hunter. Here the front, side, and the back. And production notes. Doesn't say it's a Rickle trailer. I think the sneak peek of oh, this one does not have special features either. I don't see any Deku trailers for each of the film, seven, eight movies. The film is two, three hour, three hours and three minutes. Put that aside. Next is E.T. the extra, the extra, extra seal. This came out in 1982. 82 front, side, and the back. Next is American Graffiti. This came out 73. Front, side, the back. So this. Next is Frankenstein Dole Feature. This had me, the Wolfman, and House of Frankenstein. Front, side, and the back.
Back to the Future Part 1. This came out June, uh, July 3rd, 1985. Front, side, and back. Next is The Mighty Pit, starring Tom Hanks and Shelley Long. Came out in 1986. For the back. This has a scene selection. It has 18 chapters. That was The Mighty Pit. Next is the, the 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 Blues Brothers came out in 1980. Front starring John Belushi, John Belushi and Dan Carroll Conroy. Front side in the back. It's a double sided disc, unfortunately. Compared to, let's see, uh, this has no mention of bonus features. In this one, you have my this uh, insert. Yeah. I didn't show you like the individual releases, so. Whoops, sorry, but I almost dropped it. I'm fine. Um, let me see. Next set of movies so we have entirely uh, next is out out of africa this came out 85 front side in the back next is to kill market bird starring Gregory peck this came out 1962 side back I'm on like other ones, they have sequels, not don't have sequels. ET doesn't, Out Africa doesn't near Kill, Kill Mockingbird, which is a classic. And then Al Pacino in Scarface came out 83. Yeah, here's the side. Oh, let me move this out of the way, it makes sense. So here's the back, ton of special features. <laughs> Let's see. Let's 
Scarface. Next is The Sting, came out 73. Sigh, the back. There was a sequel after this, The Sting Part 2, which I'm on a hunt for. Animal House doesn't need, doesn't, doesn't need a sequel because just, just, you leave it as a classic. His side, this back. Special Jr. has not all of them. Put some artwork in there. Next is Clint Eastwood Collection, the Western Icon Collection. You can see it right there. Yeah, has three films in the series. Next is The Great Outdoors, starring Dan, Dan Croy and John Candy. Came out '88. Sigh, the back. Jaws 1 came out 75. Jaws 2 78. Jaws 3D came out 83. And then Jaws Part 4, The Revenge. This came out 87. The Ghost of Mr. Chicken, a classic. This one doesn't need a sequel either. Came out 1966. And then Duel came out 1971. Uh, Steven Spielberg first, not dear, but whole video on DVD, a TV movie. One hour, 30 minutes. <clears throat> that one. Moving on to the year 2000s, still in the 1990s, I believe. Next is Fletch Flies. This came out 89. Front with Cherry Chase, third side, and the back. Uh, next up is Feel of Dreams. Came out 89. Kent Costner, you're the side, you're the back. That would feel dreams. Whoops. Upside down. Plan. All right. Next up, we have continuing on Back to the Future, which I do have a which. Down there, yeah. Here is Back to the Future Part 2 and Part 3. Th uh, 2 is released in 1989. 3 is from 1990. That completes the trilogy. That's that one that finished like a trilogy. Next is Batrap. Came out 1991. Front, side, and the back. Uh, next is Jurassic Park, the full movie pack. This had Jurassic Park, Jurassic Park 2, The Lost World, Jurassic Park 3, and Jurassic World. And then Jurassic World, Fallen Kingdom. Uh, Nexus Babe, classic. 
came out in 1995. Apollo, thir Apollo 13 came out in 1995. This take place uh, 1995 is the year after movies are from 1995. Also, for also one of the best movie, Toy Story released in 1995. Nexus and the Days with Scott Lasseter. This came out in 1999. Front, side. The back. And next is American Pie. I did a video on the first three movies, which I'm on the hub for number four. And the spinoffs and the, the girls' rules. Yeah, the 2020 movie. Yeah. Front, side, and the back. Next is Full of the Game, a sequel to Phil Dreams, the sequel. I need to do a movie review on Kevin Costner's movie collection. Yeah. Hope this week. Yeah. To the front, starring Kevin Costner comes back and Kelly Preston as our new lead. Front, side, the back. Uh, special features. It then lasts in the 1990. The Mummy, starring Brian Fraser, Rachel Weisz, and John Hanna, Arnold Versal, Jonathan High, Kevin J. Con O'Connor. Yeah, you got the May forecast, uh, the May uh, voice cast, May cast, directed by Steven, Steven Stommer. In 1999, Universal Studios Home All Right res Reserve is two hours and five minutes. Okay, if I could turn these around, if I could get these in order. care of that one now we hit to the 2000s all the way to 2003 for part one first up is meet the parents star robert de niro and ben stewart stuller stuller this came out 2000 front side and the back put that over there bring on this came out 2000 front side and the back The Grinch, this came out 2000, with Jim Carrey as The Grinch, sigh, and the back. Next is The Adventure Rocking and Bullwink, the movie. So here in the front, this came out 2000, sigh, and the back. Special features. The Night Professor 2, this came out 2000, Psy, 
and the back. The Fast and the Furious just came out 2001. Front, side, and the back. Next up is Bay Dolphin 4. This came out 2001. Front, side, and the back. A few bonus features. Next, America Pie 2. This takes place after events, the first film. Front, side, and the back. Honestly, this is not my favorite movie in 2001. So, yeah. Next is Godford Park. This came out in 2001. Front, side, the back. Uh, most of these have sequels. But some of them don't have. For example, um, A Beautiful Mind doesn't need a sequel because it leave it, you just leave it as a classic. For, for, for a County Award 2001 Best Picture, there's a back. The two that set among the other ones do have single disc, which has the film, and that's it. No bonus disc either. So, yeah. The film is two hours and 16 minutes. Uh, it comes with our booklet. Insert. That was a beautiful mind. Doesn't need a sequel. But next, a sequel to The Mummy. The Mummy Returns, or Part 2. This came out in 2001. Front, side, and the back. The Boring and Dandy. This came out in 2002. It's based on the first five movie. With Matt Dandy did not return to Fort Number 4, but... No actor take his plate, replace him. I joined Matt Damon in this film. Yeah, there was so the first three we this this is the Born and Danny. There was the Born Supremacy. The Boar Ultimatum, 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 The Boring Legacy, and the and Jason Bourne, the 2016, number five. This is the four, the fifth, I mean, the original classic. It does this here. Matt Damon in front of him. From Indeedy to Supremacy, Supremacy. Exclusive interview with Matt Damon and for Inca for the explore well, making the Born Day and built a build a bridge to a spectacular upcoming sequel, the Born and Deity to Supremacy. Yeah. The DVD. So this came out two thousand two. Next, we have the Scorpion King with the the Rock. This came out in 2002. Front, side, and the back. Uh, the Man Was There is a film in the war movie. This came out in 2002. Yeah, it says here 2002 Universal Studios.
Next is 8 Mile. This came out in 2002. Front, side, and the back. You know what I put in there because... There's a disc. That's because I put a digital copy disc in the in a little uh, DVD. Uh, next is the 2003, which is the year I was born. See Biscuit. This came out in 2003. Front, side, and the back. Next, the sequel to Fast and the Furious. Too Fast, Too Furious. This came out 2003. Front, side, and the back. Uh, next is the Bruce of Might. It's a classic, one of my favorites. Front, side, and the back. Moving on to the next row, um, a set of movies. So this is from 2003 to the year 2000, uh, 2010. Yeah, I have most of these uh, has like sequel or whatnot. So let's start from top to the bottom. Next is here pad. This came out 2003. Front, side, and the back. That right there. Love Ashley. This came out in 2003. One of my favorites. A classic. Doesn't need a sequel, but turns out we got a sequel to that. It's called. Uh, About Time. Yeah, it's a sequel, but it's a prequel. So yeah, they take place after Love Ashley. Yeah. So here's the front, side, and the back. Uh, next is the last movie of 2003, Amer American American Wedding or American Pie 3. This came out in 2003. It's the last of the trilogy. Front, side, and the back. This. Uh, next, we're going to hit the year 2004 and beyond. Uh, next is Meet the Parents 2. This came out in 2004. Front, side, and the back. And then next is Ray, which I really enjoy this film. So this came out in 2004, starring Jamie, Jamie, Jamie Foxx. Front, side, and the back. To the set. There's this one. This is number two. Uh, next is Shaun of Dead. This came out in 2004. Front, side, and the back. There was a trilogy, the Carnito trilogy, which had Hot Fuzz, Hot Fuzz Paul, and The World's Ends. And then it's a two-movie pack, which the rest of them don't, don't, ha don't have like two-movie pack. I know The Secret Life of Pets had two movie on it, two movie pack. Among the other one doesn't need a uh, two pack. Like, Jaws doesn't need one. Nor E.T., the Blues Brother do. I think Blue, the Blues Brother has a two movie pack as uh, well with the sequel. Uh, this is the Andre two movie collection. Uh, Donna Dead, the Andre director's cut, and both had director's cut, both the first. The first one and the second one, Land of Dead, released in 2005. This is the last movie in 2004. So here's the front. It has a year on it, yeah. 2004, the first film, and then the second one, or standalone, a sequel, released in 2005. There's the back. Oh, it has a description on here. When a mysterious virus turned people into mindless, fresh eating zombies, and handful of survivor wedge a disseparate last stand battle last stand battle to stay alive and human. In the sequel, humanity's last remaining battle to survive the unspeakable 
True, the ravens, it's a zombie hurls herds beside their fervid. Say, are are evolving. So yeah, it's a two movie pack, and then moving on to the year two thousand five, King Kong, directed by Peter Jackson. So this came out two thousand five, front side. The back. Okay, vamos a la Walmart. Mm -hmm. Hey, we are Walmart. Where are you going? 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 Where I'm doing make of a deal, Rita. Ahorita que venga lo... Sí. Por mí te pone esto. Sí. Ahí. 